versus if you had a single piece of machinery, if something happens to that upscaling that can be done to do that, we're really like, at this point, we have offset zero. IGEN, our mission is to regenerate Earth with robotics and AI. If you look at the, some of the biggest global challenges in the world, uh, agriculture is often overlooked. And me and my co-founder and the team that we've assembled here, we're working on the pillar of society, which is the crops, the food, the clothes that we wear. I've never heard of any farmer that says, I want to use chemicals more than they have to, uh, they have to use because it's an input cost, right? You just have to spend money to use more of it. If they could use less, they will use less. Um, the way that we're, we're addressing the weeding problem is going back to the, the old age uh, technology of using a stick with a blade at the end of it, which, which we call a hoe. And so we're combining the new robotics and AI with um, the old technology of uh, a stick and a blade, putting it together and then delivering a solution to the farmers. What's very different and unique about us is that we've constrained our technology with the energy uh, density of what the sun is able to provide. The same energy source that's able to grow the plants, we want to be able to use that to power the robots. So we do have batteries uh, in the robot, but it does not require any uh, uh, swapping out the batteries or having to go to a fixed position for a recharge. Each robot has 10 motors. Six of those motors are used for the arms on the robot. And as the robot drives by, it's able to identify the weed and basically plug it out with a hoe as it drives by with precision. So it actually strikes the weed and pulls it out as it goes by. So instead of saying, hey, we're gonna ban these chemicals, what we wanna do is provide an alternative that's lower cost than the existing solution. So it ends up not becoming a political issue if you can just say we have a better solution that's more affordable for possibly like the first time um, compared to chemicals and that is also a win for the health and for the environment. We, you know, companies like iGen, uh, they, are, they may be small now, um, but they're going to, we believe that they're going to be the uh, industry giants of the future. So I think of like Ford and the Model T or Edison and the light bulb. Um, Kenny and iGen um, are going to be, you know, industry giants of, of, of agriculture in the future. We're going to have uh, their robots weeding farms all over the world.